This video is brought to you by mywayteaching.com. Next parameter is bond enthalpy. So bond enthalpy it is defined as the amount of energy required to break one mole of bonds of a particular type. Okay, one mole of bonds of a particular type between two atoms in a gaseous state. Between two atoms in a gaseous state. Okay, so the unit of bond enthalpy is kilojoule per mole. Okay, so this is the unit of bond enthalpy. And here, for example, hydrogen hydrogen bond enthalpy in hydrogen molecule is this is in this hydrogen molecule is how much this is 435.8 kilojoule per mole okay here then h2 this is you are getting similarly the bond enthalpy for molecules containing multiple bonds next to for example there is a oxygen molecule and n2 Okay, here this uh, this is four ninety eight kilojoule per mole. Okay, so for this one, um, this is nine forty six point zero kilojoule per mole. Okay, so this is the bond enthalpy. It is important that larger the bond dissociation enthalpy, dissociation enthalpy, stronger will be the bond in the molecule. Okay, and here consider though uh, another case in case of water H2O okay molecule the enthalpy needed to break the two OH bonds is not the same H2O in gaseous so this is plus this one so for this the enthalpy is phi naught 2 kilojoule per mole and uh, OH four twenty seven kilojoule per mole here. The difference in the value shows that the second OH bond undergoes some change because of change chemical environment. This is the reason for some difference in energy of the same OH bond in different molecule. Okay, like C2H5OH ethanol and bottom. There is a, they therefore in polyatomic molecules the term mean or average bond enthalpy is used. So uh, here. Um, this is H2O and this is OH. The difference of the value shows that the second OH here there is no second OH bond undergoes some change because of changed chemical environment. Okay, so there is a some changes in the chemical environment. So another hydrogen there is a two types of hydrogen here. One is OH, another one is again you are getting. So there is a difference so that therefore the polyatomic we are using that is polyatomic uh, the polyatomic uh, molecules there is a polyatomic molecules the term mean or average bond enthalpy is used for polyatomic molecules the term mean or average bond enthalpy is used okay so it is obtained by dividing total bond dissoci dissociation enthalpy by the number of bonds broken as expanded so for water example so the average bond enthalpy average
enthalpy is equal to this is pi naught two write down pi naught two plus four twenty seven divided by two you are getting four sixty four point five kilojoule per mole okay so this is the average bond enthalpy next topic is here bond order okay so in the lewis description of covalent bond the bond order is given by the number of bonds between the two atoms in a molecule okay so here uh, general uh, correlation is uh, useful for understanding the stabilities of molecule is that with increases in bond order bond enthalpy increases and bond length decreases okay so this is the bond order write down the definition for the bond order is given by the number of bonds between the two atoms in a molecule okay so this is the bond order and uh, coming to the coming in the iso electronic molecules iso so for the bond order okay in bond order for example consider the hydrogen h2 here single shared electron pair with single shared electron pair okay like uh, in o2 two shared electron pairs so like that this is the example means uh, h2o2 and uh, there is a n2 there are the three shared electron pairs okay so the bond order is one this is for one this is two and this is three okay these are the bond orders okay so in uh, comp then come to the iso electronic molecules in this what happens and ions have uh, here iso electronic molecules and ions have identical bond orders for example f2 and and o2 2 minus okay have a they are having the bond order one those two like uh, co and uh, no plus they are having the bond order of three so uh, that only i am explaining you in general correlation there is a correlation in between this bond order bond enthalpy and bond length okay when the bond order with this increases in bond order bond enthalpy also increases but bond length decreases okay so this is about the bond order then the next two concept is resonance structure okay resonance structure according to the concept of resonance whenever a lewis structure See, whenever a Lewis structure cannot describe a molecule accurately and number of structures with similar energy positions of a nuclear bonding and non-bonding pairs of electrons are taken as the canonical structures of the hybrid which describes the molecule accurately. It means according to the concept of resonance, whenever a single Lewis structure, we know that Lewis structure means when we represent the electrons in a dot. Okay. So, uh, structure cannot be described a molecule accurately when uh, the Lewis structure cannot describe a molecule accurately number of structures with uh, similar energy positions of nuclei bonding and non-bonding pairs of electrons are taken as the canonical structures of the hybrid which describes the molecule accurately so in deeply I will explain you about resonance structure and canonical structure okay just uh, now consider the example uh, I will show you so this is one oxygen uh, this is for uh, o3 molecule okay uh, how we can uh, represent uh, uh, in a canonical structure and resonance structure so this is the o3 molecule three oxygen atoms are the oxygen
second here uh, there are uh, one one two three four five and six okay this is the two one two this is the first chain this is the second one and i will write your resonance structure One twenty eight PM. This is one forty eight. This is one twenty. Okay, so here the structure this one and two this represents the canonical form and this represents the resonance form. Okay, so means combining of these two, you you are writing in dot. So the both side also there is a one twenty eight picometer. Okay, then thus for O three the two structures shown above constitute the canonical structures. These two are uh, represents the canonical structure okay our resonance structures and they this is the hybrid structure this represents the hybrid okay so this is also called resonance hybrid it is represented by double head arrow okay then okay. Uh, here I will write you one uh, uh, I will give the some of the problems so that you will understand what I am saying so first of all write down the structure of explain the structure explain the structure of CO3 to minus ion in terms of resonance okay here uh, the single Levy structure based on the presence of two single bonds and uh, one double bond between carbon and oxygen atoms okay single Levy structure based on the carbon and oxygen atoms see there is only one carbon O means the oxygen there are three three I have written here so one two three four these are this is so remaining one two three four five six total should be eight electrons total number of the electrons in the oxygen atom and there are the minus so that I am writing here one minus here one minus okay so it is uh, it can be represented uh, okay according to the experimental findings all carbon to oxygen bonds uh, in CO3 to minus are equivalent therefore the carbonate ion is best described as a resonance hybrid of the canonical forms so I can write here like this also or you can write uh, like uh, okay also you can write so you can write like this also this 
this is minus okay so this is the structure of resonance structure okay and the next one explain the structure of co2 molecule carbon dioxide okay the solution i will write here so you can write like resonance of co2 uh the i will uh, write down the thus they have asked to only the structure you can write the canonical structure or also resonance structure okay mm. i will write down so carbon dioxide only one c and there are the two oxygen atoms so it should have the oxygen uh, eight electron should be there so it will share with the carbon i have already discussed this topic okay okay this one or uh, the second one is uh, oxygen this is carbon again oxygen 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 okay your shared pair of electrons like this and this is you have to write plus here and this one is minus and the next one is uh, oxygen again carbon and oxygen or there should be shared pair of electron here minus so this is the structure of the carbon dioxide in general it may be not it may be stated that write down the points uh, re resonance stabilizes the molecule as the energy of the resonance hybrid is less than the energy of any single canonical structure resonance resonance stabilizes the molecule okay next resonance stabilizes the molecule as the energy of the resonance hybrid okay it is uh, there is a continuation uh, uh, the energy of the resonance hybrid is less than the energy of any single canonical structure resonance uh, averages the bond characteristics as a whole resonance averages the bond characteristics as a whole okay so the this is the gen in general it can be stated like this next is this is uh, the end of the topic of resonance okay